Yeah, yeah, I wanted to ask you. Yeah. How much money do you make? Asking about money on the first date is the craziest thing I've ever heard in my life because that's one of the most personal things that you can ever ask a grown ass man. Any adult, really. Sometimes people be in relationship for years and they don't know how much the other person makes. This woman pulled up day one like the IRS, bro. Worse than the IRS because at least the IRS is going to ask you for your first and last name before you file, you know, before they, they know how much you make and how much they're getting. She want to know right off the bat. She didn't even take two sips of that drink. That drink is still full, people. <laughs> like, I, I don't, don't want to seem like a you know interested in like money and stuff but I just wanna come out from the get go to tell you like I think I'm not a gold digger or anything fellas if a woman ever asks you how much money you make and then she follows up with, I'm not a gold digger or anything, run. That's exactly what she is, man. She just exposed herself. But I just don't go out with broke boys. And on top of that, she says, I don't date broke boys. Honey, let me tell you something. You met a man at the Applebee's. You a broke girl. Everything about your screen's broke. If you was a real gold digger, if you really didn't date broke boys, as soon as that boy started typing Applebee's, man, before he even got to the B's, you would have blocked him. <laughs> what the fuck is you talking about? Yeah. I so, think I, I made good enough. And know. I know you just took me to Applebee's. Like, I get it. Maybe you don't want to take me to the most fanciest place, like, on the first date, but never again are you going to take oh, me well, next time, next time we can go somewhere else, bro. Like, Applebee's is not acceptable. Right. I am not. I'm high We're just getting to know each other. You're not even my girl. That's a great point right there. You're not even my girl. We're just getting to know each other. Why should I go out my way to do all this fancy stuff for you? It's not fancy enough. I'm high maintenance. I'm not a gold digger. How much do you make? This woman is a walking red flag, people. Well, yeah, but this is dating to marry, right? Did she just say that she dates to marry? What? This is how you know that this woman hit the woman. This is how you know that that biological clock is ticking, man. And she's trying to latch on to anything. That's why she's an Applebee's. How she says she's dating to marry. Who does that? Who goes on a first date and is thinking about marriage? You know who? A person under pressure. That's who. Man, I hope this guy does not take this woman on a second date because he's going to live to regret it. <laughs> well, who knows? And if I date, it's not to waste my time. So I'm not going to be going out and going to you know cheap restaurants so you've been dating wasting your time your whole life and now you want to come put the pressure on this man right here talking about like nah i'm here to get married i want to know how much you make i'm not a gold digger though I'm not a gold digger but don't bring me to no cheap restaurants this is beneath me this isn't fancy what's wrong with you what kind of man takes a woman on a date to applebee's on their first day the best thing that this man did was take that woman to applebee's fast i'm gonna tell you something when you're getting to know a woman set the bar very low at the beginning because that's gonna tell you everything about her moral character you understand? Applebee's is a great test. You know, even Mickey D's, anything that's not fancy. Because what you're trying to do is you're trying to make sure that you get with a woman that's there for you and not necessarily for the experience around you. That's what you want out of a woman. You understand what I'm saying? Because that woman is literally interested in you. She don't give you an Applebee's. She don't give it's Olive Garden. If it's Taco Bell, she's there for you. And wherever you go with her, that's what she's going to follow. That's the kind of woman you want in your life. So this is a good test right here because right off the bat, I want to be like, nope, I would have got up and left. I wouldn't even have entertained that conversation any further than how much money do you make because I don't date broke boys. And I don't know, people, man. Maybe religion got it right. Maybe we're not supposed to be up in age dating and trying to get to know people and stuff, especially if you're a woman. Men have age on their side, you know, because we age like one. Women, on the other hand, you know, there's, there's the biological clock that starts ticking once the woman starts getting into her late 20s and there's nothing that she could do to control it. There's a lot of women out there, man, that don't even want kids. And when that biological clock starts ticking, Oh, man, they're in heat, man. They're trying to latch on to any man to fucking procreate. So, yeah, fellas, be careful, man. If you pull up to the date, uh, asking how much money you make, <laughs> give her the middle fingers. <laughs> but anyway, guys, if you like the content, make sure you subscribe. I got some more heat coming your way, man. Go check out the merch shop. Get yourself a coffee mug, a T-shirt, or a hoodie. I'll see you next time. Peace.